boys and girls. Today we're going to talk about an artist. His name is Romero Brito. He is a current an artist living in Miami right now. And I posted a video, a YouTube video on the hub that shows a little bit about his life and his artwork. He is a very accomplished artist. He's still working today. And he has worked with many, many, many um, companies and people and celebrities. And since we're talking about pop art, his style can be considered a little bit of kind of pop art. He has his own style. But here are some of his images that, uh, his pictures that are um, paintings rather that are um, iconic. So here's one that's extremely popular. You may have seen these. He's um, done work for Disney. He's done work for many different companies. He does portraits, Mickey Mouse. He's got some simple images. So he does a simple image, a simple thing, and then he'll fill it in with his, his trademark colors. So he tries to use the same colors all the time. He says he keeps consistent with his colors. And everything's always outlined with this bold black. And look, he's done things for the Olympics, for Evian Water, the White House. He did a sculpture for the White House in 2008. And you can look him up and see more of his stuff. I love this one. This is a portrait of his mother and son. And there's a good picture of him. So he is just inspiring, and I thought we could do a little Valentine's card um, inspired by him and his art, since we were talking about pop art. Um, this is one we, um, <clears throat> we are going to do with kindergarten. And so we're starting, I mean, kinder first and second, pretty much all are gonna do, there's this style. We're gonna use um, these kids' paints, their dot paints, instead of dotting everything we're going to draw with it so on this one i drew it with the, with these dot paints i don't happen to have black here so i'm going to use a black marker and then use my dot paints to fill in so i'm just going to use a big black marker i'm just going to make a heart get my dot paint. I'm going to go ahead and just do a few. Now remember, we're not just dotting everything. Romero did use a lot of um, dots in his artwork. That doesn't mean you have to dot everything. And you can vary the size of the dots. The dots don't always have to be um, exactly the size of this. look shiny. This, these are shimmer, I think. Yep, shimmer, kids paint. They're real easy to use. And they're handy during the pandemic because at school we can use just one or two of them and then the rest we can use crayons. This one's kind of old.
kind of let it dry. And then you can come back, come back and draw. Add some details with crayons or markers, whichever you prefer. Valentine's Day in one of the sections. If you look at Romero Brito's artwork, he always puts his signature, this is like his last name, his signature, he always puts it in his work. So he uses these little, they look like little squiggles, but it's part of his signature. So you can see it even in the Mickey behind. All right, so that's it, boys and girls. I um, hope you enjoyed that project, and if you don't have the dot paint, remember you can just use markers and crayons. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Happy Valentine's Day.